drivers behind the line. Three, two, one, go. All righty. 2577 doing a dance over here in the uh, red tarmac. It's not worth any points, but it's pretty entertaining. 12 points to six, a bunch of cargo shots. Overshot by Team 41. Nobody gaining the advantage with the cargo bonus. So we enter the teleoperator period. Team 2070, the Royals, connecting with one low for the Blue Alliance. One shot going up high for the red. One point difference right now. Royals looking to pull away with the Blue Alliance. Nicely done. Three shots going down low. Six cargo in for the blue. Five cargo in for the red. Excuse me, four cargo in for the red. Two point difference right now. 90 seconds left on the clock. Team 219 impact, shoots one up, it's good. Two, just off the mark. One point difference still. Blue Alliance slowly climbing through, climbing up through that cargo threshold. Seven pieces for them, six pieces for the red. Making it seven now it is the Robo Warriors. Dropping two off, down low. Nicely done here. Two nineteen, looking to get back to their launch pads, trying to shoot from far back. Doesn't quite make the first one. Goes up for the second, misses. Just a bit left. Forty seconds to go now. Twenty nine to twenty, blue advantage. All right, the Robo Warriors from downtown nailing two shots up high, trying to close the gap between the red and the blue alliance. 303 for the Red Alliance. Looks like they're trying to sneak into the hangar zone with the rest of their partners. Pingree and the Robo Warriors going up for red. Nicely done there. They're gonna hang out on the mid rung. Team Impact trying to do the same for blue. Six seconds to go. Robo Warriors make it up high. Three, two, one. Time runs out here on the field. Real time score has Blue Alliance with the advantage, but we will see how these hangs affect the final score. Stay tuned. Green lights on the field indicate teams can come out and collect the robots, and the next set of teams can be loaded on. Okay, in that match, Team 2577 was assessed a yellow card for egregiously holding more than two cargo consistently. That is a yellow card, and that is a violation of rule G043. Oh, excuse me, G403. So, with that, well, we'll get your scores in a second. Just kidding.
All right, your results for match 17 going up on the board. The winner is the Red Alliance with a score of 48 to 26. Again, Team 2577 was assessed a yellow card for egregious holding of more than three cargo, or more than two cargo, excuse me.